My name is David Bailey, Chairman of APT Leicester Limited. I really am now almost consultant stroke mentor for the business which is now in the hands of Angela, my daughter, she's Managing Director. Uh, so that means that I've got more spare time now, I can indulge in things that I would like to do rather than things I've got to do. I originally started in 1964 and worked for my father-in-law, Fred Paul, um, and it was in 1970 that we formed a new company and this is where APT um, started life and we carried the business on. We now got 19 CNC machines backed up with all the uh, necessary software and ancillaries. My name's Nick Banner and I'm Operations Director at APT. Well, we do a, a quite a bit of customer liaison we developed our customers over many years and got many loyal customers to go out and see them it, it, and help them if anything we can do, if there's anything else we can do for them. Because very often you go to these places and, and they don't realise that you can produce that type of part. They don't realise that you produce that type of material. Uh, for instance, we went to a customer not long ago and he didn't realise that we produced plastic parts. So the eventuality of that was he sent some inquiries over. We're now producing plastic parts for that customer and he's absolutely over the moon. My name's Angela Whitmore. I'm Managing Director of APT. The company's always been here since I was very small and I used to spend time with my parents at work and it's definitely a big part of my life. So I've just grown up around it. I believe strongly in harnessing modern techniques while we maintain traditional values. My name's Simon Dealey. I've worked for APT for just over two and a half years. My current role is a technical manager. My roles include quality control, inspection, looking after our AS9100 standards, our aerospace standard. I also work closely with the shop floor staff for any technical issues they may have regarding tooling, drawings, methods. I also work very closely with our suppliers, so we're making sure we're using the latest tooling and uh, the best methods we possibly can. A big thing I think about this company is the continuous improvement. Because when I started here, you know, that, those two words, I've never heard them being spoken about so much in a company, really. Continuous improvement is a big part of, of the job here, and it's a big part of my job, so we're always moving forwards. And my name's Andy Stone. I'm the production manager at APT, responsible for planning the workloads on the machines, liaising with the customers. It's, I think it's, the structure is, is brilliant. We have a lot of new machines. We've got such a, a broad customer base. We get to, to make washers right up to parts for the, the energy sector, which can be quite complex. A lot of the machines we do now, they're multi-spindle, multi-axis, all singing, all dancing. We've got a, a very good range of machines. Sliding heads, fixed heads. We've got a lot of, lot of years of skill and knowledge out there. We're doing apprenticeship every two to three years. We've had some brilliant lads come out of that. My name's uh, Mike Shelwin. I've been Predominantly APT for seven years, in charge of the Mianos, fixed heads. We have apprentices here, we tend to mentor them and bring them up through basically learning everything they need to know within machines and engineering in general. Uh, we've got guys that have been through the um, apprentice era, come out the other end and now these are getting to be in with the top setters. My name is Jordan Martin. I'm a trainee programmer and setter. I work on the star machines, mainly the SR10s. I went to college for two years and got a MVQ level two. Um, when I was an apprentice, it was just mainly setting and learning and operating, but now I've gone into programming as well. It's a good family company. And the apprenticeship scheme, I think it gave me a much better chance of getting this job. When everybody leaves at the end of the day, everything doesn't stop. The machines carry on running through the night and some will finish the batch that they're on in the early hours. I think because of how APT is run and managed, that, you know, we know we've got a good future. We've got a lot of, lot of years. For the future, I see it going forward with the, the current management team, which are excellent. The current team of setters, which are superb. Uh, we are actually bringing in the younger generation so that we don't run out of years. The customer base is getting a lot more secure than it has been in the past. We've got some blue chip customers that are very busy with us and ongoing the future looks bright. 
I think we've got a very good, strong team now and I'll be taking it further into the future.